Hello and welcome everyone. Uh, this is Tomb Raider Crony and I'm going to play through Tomb Raider 2. And uh, let's uh, start straight away, I would say. Okay, here we go. This game might look pretty old, and yeah, it is. It was released in 1997, and this is uh, the second game of the Tomb Raider series. Uh, it was pretty successful, actually. Uh, the first game was even more successful than uh, Tomb Raider 2, uh, but uh, this one is uh, my favorite of the classic games. No, Winston, don't leave me here. I will close you in the fridge for that. And, and in the cliff manor, uh, there is a separate level, uh, Lara's home. <laughs> and you can close the butler in the fridge there. Whoa. Kitty cat. There. I feel sorry for killing them. And this was uh, the first uh, Tomb Raider game I've ever played. A great old demo. And I played it uh, so many times. And also I was listening to Britney Spears at the same time. It seemed to fit. It's uh, really embarrassing. But it was like 10 years ago or so. So that, uh, that's understandable. I mean, the rhythm... <laughs> really uh, fit th the gameplay in a way Laura uh, ran around and jumped and etc. I'll show you.
Okay, enough of kidding and let's do this. Uh, first time I played this one, this jump took me ages to do correctly. You have to, basically you have to step off that uh, stone ledge and uh, a lot of speed will be in the air while you jump. What a nice view. I always missed it previously, as uh, I had the pistols out because I knew these annoying crowds will, uh, are going to uh, come. There are three of them. Oh, I died. Um, this level is actually uh, a bit hard as a starter level. Um, even <laughs> in Tomb Raider 1 and uh, all the other games, it's perhaps a bit easier. It's full of traps and all the like. All these stretch textures look really strange. But yeah, back in the day, it wasn't uh, so easy to make. Uh, to avoid these, I mean. Oh, that is mean. Put some sh uh, shotgun bullets on your face. Come here, because you scared me. Hey! Oh, uh, finally. And now we are out of shotgun ammo, great. There were only two. I was always scared of this part uh, when I was younger and w was playing it for the first time. I don't like these... Yeah, if you get what I mean. There are these sneaky little spiders coming out from the corners. Oh! <laughs> it's pretty funny how they fall into pieces. climb up instead. Don't trust myself with that jump. And here... Yeah, there's a sneaky little bastard waiting for us up there. Not very nice. And also a key you have to get there. But we can avoid it by, uh -huh. by uh, rolling around. Rusty key. Ooh, spider webs. Ah, uh, yay. That's pretty cool. And there's one even behind you, and you're happy you got rid of the three uh, that uh -huh. uh, came from the ceiling. And there's one uh, behind your back and attacks you if you uh, don't pay attention. And here comes the harder part. I was already talking about. I used to just uh, cross this and uh, I was lucky if those uh, blades didn't hurt me. Actually I didn't notice uh, this crack in the wall where I can easily avoid uh, those traps. I only noticed it for my... I don't know what number it was. Uh, I played it through like uh, two times and uh, played the first level a billion times. I lost count. There are the, these uh, blades from even two sides. And I think I'm going to save here.
because now we have to run! And yeah, like Laura said in the Guardian flight, and even they put some spikes in here. Oh, I'm going to grab these. Uh -huh. I hope I can do it. Come on. I'm going to get hurt. Ah! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> That was very close. I was lucky there. Uh, and I think I'm going to use a small medipack. Use it. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you can see what I mean about difficulty here. Usually, don't have a problem with these, but. I'm going to use a large medipack instead. Oh, spikes! And I would also like to grab the second secret in this level, Jade Dragon. And yeah, at the same time, these spiky walls are chasing you. <laughs> if you're not fast enough, you cannot get this secret. Come on, break! Whoa. And yeah, even uh, despite the fact I played this level whoa, a lot of times, uh -huh. I still die. I'm going to save again. Have you seen that, by the way? It was very close to Laura's head when I picked up that medipack. And even here are some really sneaky uh, spiders coming out of every corner. Um, whoa, hey! You're annoying! Oh, that's deep. So yeah, um, this um, zipline or what, whatever it's called, might look um, um, pretty. Well, had something like, um, "Use me right now! Come on, I'm here! Slide down!" But don't use this uh, just yet, and uh, if you don't resist uh, the temptation. You might miss an important secret with um, some nice enemies and don't want to give it away if you haven't played the game yet. But um, you really shouldn't miss this. Oh, come on, Lara, you're so slow. <coughs> Shimming in the first five games, yeah, even in the sixth. Uh, game is very very slow and sometimes there are uh, some pretty long um, shimmy distances you have to make and yeah this is what I call a ladder and this is what I call darkness I'm gonna save and light a flare, if I can find a button. Oh yeah. And guess what? Here down, we are down, I mean. The bottom of the large pit and what the f- ah. No matter how many times I played this game, and this bloody T-Rex always, always scares me. It's really worth it uh, going down here because we can get a grenade launcher right at the beginning of the game. Ooh. Your breath smells bad. And we can get rid of uh, the T-Rex by 
two, the two T-Rexes by just shooting them with the pistols because they can't uh, come here. Yeah. Blizzards. Oh, oh, oh. Its hand got through the wall. Have you seen that? that that's called cheating. You cannot come here. Die, die already. Yeah, your breath smells really bad. Um, yeah. Oh, poor things. I don't feel sorry for you. Sorry. Yeah, how many people got died here? This can really... Uh, if you find it uh, when you play for the first time, it can really scare you. It's a shame I'm not doing it blind, blindly. It would have scared the shit out of my pants <laughs> or something like that. Um, yeah, in every level there are uh, three secrets. A stone dragon, a jade dragon and a golden dragon. Oh, complete darkness. Don't you just love that? Um, yeah, the stone dragon is the easiest one to get. And obviously the golden dragon is the hardest one to find. As you can see in this level, there, are, there were two huge dinosaurs you had to shoot down here. It's a very cool by the way. Uh, let's find a way back and hopefully I don't fall down or something. So let's be safe and save. Oh, oh, yeah, that was uh, what I, I was talking about. Great. Oh, yeah. Oh. Laura joins the skeletons. I'll just choose the normal way and shimmy. I, I thought, for some reason, I thought those ledges were safe. Don't know why. Oh, and I think I can hear the spiders again. They are very annoying. I hate them. I forgot the way back. Please, someone help me. <coughs> oh, that's too big. And I think that ledge isn't safe. Where do I have to go back? Oh my god. <coughs> no! Oh crap. Yeah, I thought I knew, but it was quite a lot of, lot of time since last time I played this one. And you have you come back right up there or something. Oh come on. <coughs> uh oh. Maybe I had to climb the top of that ladder. I was wondering where it leads or why it leads to a solid wall. But yeah, it was my mistake. I forgot that this leads back, actually. I 
didn't look up above my head. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Well, at least I found a way. There are worse times when I get stuck and don't know what to do. And I run around for like a lot of time. music is playing again? Was it supposed to? It plays for the second time or so. But I would say let's try this. Wee! <laughs> and we're we got to the other side of the pit. And there are two tigers coming. Well, I think they are they are two Here's the other one. Uh oh. Or I didn't want to jump. That was I wasted a lot of medipacks this time. And here is the final part. This is the final room. Oh, uh, fire. What the? Ah, oh, no! What? I. Oh, crap. That fire isn't even 3D and. It tricked me. Oh dear. <laughs> How can I be so stupid? So yeah, there's a pretty cold climate in this uh, wall, great wall, inside these caves. But do not touch the fire. Normal people don't do, but I do. Yeah. The laptop disappears. So, this was the first level of the game. Um, thank you very much for watching. There's nice and interesting cutscene coming. See you later. Thank you. Bye. Pardon me, if that was just your way of trying the doors for me. <laughs> Leave that Tommy gun on my keyring. Though not anymore. So after you. Somehow, you don't behave like you got a monk's blood. I understand that somehow is in my favor. So indulge me about the dagger. I'd be indebted with your life. These doors are waiting for the right one. The right time to arrive. And then the dagger's blade will honor the hearts of those who believe. So unless you pledge your loyalty as well. And which one is that? To the sins and fortunes of Marco Bartoli. Perhaps not just yet then. Aha, Gianni Bartelli, Via Caravelli, Venice.